Hey guys and welcome to the Chimpanzee Habitat Guide for Planet Zoo. The video where I'm going to be showing you how to build a really good habitat for your chimpanzees. If this video is helpful, please do leave a like, a comment for the algorithm and don't subscribe. So let's get into it. Starting off with the basics, your chimpanzee will need a fairly decently sized habitat. It will need to be at least 780 meters squared, which is just slightly smaller than this one here. However, you can go quite a bit bigger. Then, the next thing is that you will obviously need glass to show off um, for your visitors, and you will also need a habitat door to let the zookeepers in. Now, the next thing is that walls that you build the habitat out of must be at least resistance grade 3, otherwise the chimpanzees will break through them. The next thing is, they either need to be not climbable, like say this glass here, it says not climbable, or you can use a, um, a barrier that is climbable, but then simply select the barrier individually, go to settings here, and then set it to climb proof and make it both. That way your animal will not be able to climb over. Make sure you do this for every single wall that is not a non-climbable wall like the glass here. So now that your chimpanzee is fully enclosed, let's try and make them happy. So the chimpanzees have quite a few things that you've got to try and do. We'll start off with the terrain first. So firstly, they need hard shelter. Hard shelter can be pretty much anything. I recommend just spamming rocks in like a corner. You can do it smaller than this. It doesn't need to be this big. Um, at the same time as well, they will also need some bedding in that shelter. So what you want to do here is you want to go into filters, species, oh, whoopsies, species, and then find the western chimpanzee all the way down the bottom and set it to that filter. That way anything we're looking at we can use for the chimpanzee. So as long as any of this bedding is in the shelter, you'll be fine. Now the next thing is that the chimpanzee needs at least 80 meters squared of climbing area because they're a primate. So if we go into habitat, Sorry, not habitat. If we go into... Yeah, so if we go into habitat and then go enrichment items and then all, all we can go down to climbable, you can use... You can find all the things that you can use to count for that climbing area. Now, you can just spam things around or you can try and make something nice or you can have blueprints on so that you can see pre-made ones. So just for this sake, I'm going to find one and chuck it in and we'll see how that improves his um, happiness in regards to the climbing. So I've just put that one in. It's gone up a little bit so you might need a few of them. I'm just going to go in and I'm going to build a few of those. I might chuck down some of the um, non-blueprint stuff as well. So just like you can do this stuff all around the place. You can build these things on top of it. Obviously you can make it look nice. I'm not going to be trying to do that. I'm just going to spam them around a little bit. Um, just to try and get the enough climbing area. So if you've got your um, chimpanzee selected while you're building it, you can actually see how you're impacting that. So if you just want it to be effective and not look nice, you could just chuck down a massive platform like this and do a couple of those, and that will be enough for it to be happy in ha navigable climbing area. So that's enough of that. So it's now got enough land area and enough climbing area. Even though it looks absolutely rubbish, you can make it look nice just as long as you've got the good area. Now the next thing you need is you need a little bit of short grass and also a little bit of long grass. So because I've done a grassland biome, there's quite a bit of long grass here. We don't want that much. So if we just go into terrain, sorry, yeah, terrain and then go painting. And then you want to look at what we need more of. Now, obviously, it needs a lot of soil. So if we just spam click, or if we just click this, it'll change it to what we need. So we need soil heavy, and we want to make a whole load of that. So just use your tool and get a whole load more soil heavy in to get rid of the long grass that takes up a lot of the enclosure. So there we go. We've got enough soil now, but in the, mean, in the process, I've kind of removed a little bit too much of the short grass. So what we'll do is we'll just... Get a little bit of short grass in here. And now it's happy in regards to everything in terrain. Then we can go into environment. Now, the animal needs quite a few different things from the tropical biome to make it happy. So you want tropical and African content, continent stuff. So you just want to go through and just add anything that is tropical 
and African. So if we just go into continent, switch it to Africa, so we've got the We've now got two of the filters on Africa and Tropical. Now any of this thing, the chimpanzee will be likely to like. So obviously I'm adding in a whole lot of trees. You can do bushes, you can do plants, you can do whatever it is that you like. Now it may take a few different things to actually make the chimpanzee happy. Obviously you wouldn't spam as many things as big as this. But as you can see, it's gotten the coverage up and it is now happy with that. So as you can see, here are the different plants that we've put in the habitat to make it happy. Okay, next up we've got enrichment. So we need food enrichment and toy enrichment in the habitat. So to find the enrichment stuff, go to habitat, and then enrichment items, and then you want to sort by the certain different things. So we'll do food enrichment, keep your western chimpanzee um, filter on, and then you'll find anything that is an enrichment item for the chimpanzee. And as you place them down, it'll make the animal happier. You can do a few different things, termite mounds, all that sort of stuff, until it gets back up to 100%. Then you want to do some toy enrichment, click on toys, keep the filter on, and you can do a few different things here. So you can do like a sprinkler, block of ice, drum, whatever makes the animal happy. Now the chimpanzees need quite a few different forms of um, toy enrichment. So obviously you wouldn't normally spam them around like I am. Um, but as you can see, we're back up to 100% toy enrichment. So now if we look at the animal, it's actually looking pretty damn happy. The enrichment's at 100%, habitat's at 100%, nutrition isn't quite up there. But now we've got social to look at. So enrichment's all the way up, that's looking good. And the next thing big that you can manage with the habitat is social. So now the most important things with the chimpanzees is that they need quite a few chimpanzees. Now, a, it'll need basically a pack or a group of 10 to 15 to actually be happy. Now, I'm not going to bother going through buying every single chimpanzee and sending it to my zoo, as that may take a bit of time. But I will send a couple here just to show you that you do need a couple more chimpanzees for them to be happy. So we'll just quickly do this, send to zoo, and then chuck them all in here. And as you see, or as you will see in a moment, as the chimpanzees get put in, they will be happier as the adult population will grow. So it's currently at one, the bar's all the way down there, two, three, four, it's going up a little bit more. So you can have a minimum of five, but you probably want more than that for the animals to actually be truly very happy. Now the only other thing to note as well is that as you add in more chimpanzees, if I can just select one here, um, you will find that the hard shelter will go down a little bit. So to do this, you just want to um, place down some more bedding for your animals and put it in a bit more shelter, and that will make them happier. So you may need to build up a few more shelters just for them. But yeah, so that is a basic chimpanzee habitat. As you can see, we are green on all the values and the animal would be pretty happy. So that is how you make a chimpanzee habitat in Planet Zoo. If this video was helpful, please do leave a like, a comment for the algorithm, and don't subscribe.